Thanks so much for watching. Voters in Illinois will fill out their primary ballots tomorrow, but in District 102, there is a unique race. The Republican nominee will be determined by a write-in ballot. Will Price joins us now to break down the situation after he spoke to both candidates involved. Will. Yeah, Mike, it's pretty unique. The two people involved, incumbent Adam Niemerg as well as Jim Acklett. It was back in January when the state's Board of Elections officially removed Niemerg from the ballot, which means for residents in District 102, you will have to write in your choice tomorrow. Niemerg was removed after a dispute on his statement of candidacy being notarized. He did not agree with that decision, but he says that in the week since, he has been working to inform residents on just how the vote will work this year. The moment that we knew that this the, the, that we were going to be removed off the ballot, um, I started working 16, 18 hour days to make sure uh, that folks in the district understood what was going on and understand what we're up against here. His opponent, Acklin, decided to join the race. Once this situation popped up, he was asked back in December, and the current mayor of Ogden says that it's been a hectic two months since he agreed, but he is eager to see what will happen tomorrow at the polls. I've had people ask me, well, what do the polls say? Well, I said, there, there is no polling. I don't know how you would predict a, a, a situation where nobody's on the ballot. And that's, as you said earlier, that's what makes it unique. Uh, it certainly will be interesting. And a couple more important notes, both Niemerg and Ackland say that the name will not have to be spelled completely correctly as county clerks will give credit for a quote, reasonable attempt. And given the nature of this race, results will not be expected for at least a couple of days. Mike.